To you, sets of the shrine, I am Almanau. In the name of the goddess highly I offer this trial. Oh shoot, this is where we get Magnesis. Let's go. Give me Magnesis, I need that. Okay, I definitely need to change up the brightness of my camera. I'll probably do it in the next video. Okay, so, Magnesis time, let's go. Drop her down. Huh. We running and we running and we running and we run and we jump and we going. Time to push. Ooh, we can push. Ooh, let's push stuff. What is you? Can I not deal with you? Can I knock stuff? Ah! <laughs> Let's go. We can knock stuff about. Hey, yo, give me this stuff. Ancient spring? Let's go. Alright, let's try doing this this time with a little more effort and less failure. I think I could just. I, think I could just leave it like that. Perfect. Alrighty. Get ourselves this treasure. Perfect. Bam! Let's go. Alright. Open up the doors! And let me go inside. Please. Hey there, monk. Sheikah monk. Am I gonna touch this? Then break it open there. You have proven to possess the resolve of a hero. Of a true hero. I am Omen Owl, creator of this trial. Hmm. You put all that stuff together? I am a humble monk, blessed with the sight of the goddess of Hylia and the dedicated helping those defeat Ganon. With your arrival, my duty is now fulfilled. Well, thank you. Well, you're welcome, I guess. <laughs> In the name of Goddess Hylia, I allow, allow me to bestow this gift upon you. Please accept this spirit orb. Okay. Alrighty, alright, I see you. I mean, he doesn't exactly have the Triforce in the middle, but that's fine. I don't think the Triforce has ever been a thing used in this game, so... Here's the, uh... Spirit orb. May the goddess smile upon you. Alrighty. Let us get ourselves out of here. Oh, you just... you just come out of nowhere? It seems you managed to get your hands on a spirit orb. Well done. How did you know? Clairvoyance! Oh, or perhaps just something similar. As one gets older, it can become more difficult to see what is right before one's own eyes. However, that which was once hidden from view can often be crystal clear. But perhaps that is not true for everyone. Oh, ho, ho. The appearance of those towers and the awakening of the shrine. Hmm. It is all connected to that Sheikah slate you carry on your hip there. What do you mean? Oh. It has been quite some time since I have seen that Sheikah slate. Long ago, a highly advanced tribe known as the Sheikah inhabited these lands. The great power of their wisdom saved the kingdom time and time again. But their ancient technology disappeared long ago. Or so it is said. 
It is interesting, however, to think how something like that survived all this time, hidden away in a shrine. These shrines are tucked away in numerous places across this land. On this plateau alone, I believe there are th still three more. Bring me the treasure from each of those shrines and I will give you the, my cleric lighter. So, I need more now? I said treasure, but I never said there would be more than there would only be one treasure. Whether it's one treasure or four, what's the difference for a young go-getter like yourself? Since I'm feeling generous, I will also cheat you to trick for finding shrines. It's always best to... Okay, yeah. Vantage points. Vantage points. It's all... You teach me about the vantage point, you're also teaching me how, how to, uh... Teleport, essentially. Okay, thank you very much. I shall be doing that momentarily. Alrighty, onwards. Okay, that's the wrong button. Let's go to our Sheikah Slate, and we are going to... Here's path mode. Unlock. Press X on the map screen to see your journey's path thus far. Thus far, okay. Oh, that's cool. I mean, we didn't explore all of um the Great Plateau. I might actually do that. After we get to this tower. Besides, we're going to have to. Anyways, besides, because of the uh, shrine. So let's go uh, go uh, teleport ourselves over to the um, Great Plateau Tower. Man, this game's fun. And um, you guys didn't know in the earlier build, this loading screen was much longer. It was much, much longer. I am so glad I'm playing this, the current, well, latest update, I guess, of Breath of the Wild, where the things are much more better. I know exactly what I gotta do. So what we're gonna do is we gotta mark off all of these things. Go right to the Sheikah Slate, and we gotta mark right, right there. There's that. Mark off another one right over there. We can also mark off, um... Okay, so we got three shrines to mark off. Oh, nope, nope, didn't want that. I wanted to... Center it a little bit better. Okay, so those are all on the Great Plateau, but we also have... Another tower, I believe. It should be right at the... The Twin Peaks, so we'll... Mark that one, because I know we'll have to go there. And then we might as well mark off the one that's right over here, because it looks like... It just looks... It's close. It looks inviting. So we have many marked locations. So let's go, um... Go jump back down there. I think I might do a quick... I, no, that's not doing any quick cuts. Unless it's, like, something that I've already been to, I'm not going to do any quick cuts. We're just going to jump down get right into the action here okay I like how there's a certain height limit that you have also I love the music when you go near the t when you go near the towers all right which one should we do first I say we do the Eastern Abbey one first I say we go all the way around in one circle and then we go right I guess we could go We'll go explore the forest right after we do this uh, last one here. Yeah, sounds like a good idea. Alrighty. There we go. Away from the tower. I kind of want to tackle this camp here. Let's see how that goes. Oop, wrong button. I always forget X's jump. I wish you could, like, change the buttons to where X was attack and then Y was jump. I don't know, it kind of just makes sense, because I'm used to, like, Mario games where... Because you know why the Y button would be, um, run, and then the B button would be jump? Also, I'm going to see if I can, uh, take out this guy without being spotted. How good is my aim? I have 14 arrows. Oh! Flawless! Okay. Oh, I know what to do. Oh, I know what to do. Hold up. Time for the aim, time for the immaculate aim. Oh, that was terrible. Oh, no. Oh, it's swinging. 
Oh, I gotta get it right as it swings. Or maybe I can wait till it stops. Can I wait till it stops? Oh. Oh! Okay, so we only have one to fight. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. That's even better. Oh, hi, hey, hey there. Uh, I'm gonna attack you. Ow. I said I wanted to attack you because you have a weapon that I might use against you. Yep, I'm about to beat you with your own weapon. Alright. Put that away so then we don't, um, burn it. And then I'll lose it. Because it's a pretty good weapon. Alrighty. Uh, weapons, 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 weapons. Let's go right to... Uh, let's go right to the weaker ones. I kind of want to get rid of those. I kind of want to, like, throw the, uh, weaker ones at the enemies and then just use my strong ones. Oh, no! Bo! Bo, 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 bo. Okay, cool. Bo, go! And what's in this treasure chest? Ooh, fire arrows! Don't mind if I do! Definitely gonna be useful. Alright, where were we? We gotta go back on our... We were off the beaten path for a little bit, but you know what? That is fine, because this is... You're meant to go off the beaten path in this uh, game. Alrighty. Definitely want to avoid g jumping off of there. Okay. So we're near the Eastern Abbey. I know we can climb up there, but I kind of want to be careful, because I know there's guardians. There are guardians in this Eastern Abbey here. Definitely gotta watch out, especially that one. I don't trust that one. Um, is there one? Can I? Cl I can climb up this. Oh, oh! I forgot there was one there. Oh no. Um. Um. Uh. Okay, we're good. Okay, we're good. Okay. Ya, ya, bye. Is that actually how you pronounce it? Is it? Is it bad? Ya, bye. Is that what it means? It's like the it's like the J pronounced as like a Y, so it's like So it's like the Japanese word for bad, Yabai? It's Yabai Shrine. It's the bad shrine. <laughs> That's cool. I think it's definitely going to be good if I... Okay, so loading screens and such like that, I'll probably just cut ahead. I'll cut ahead from it. I think it'll just make more sense. Alright. Bomb trial. Oh yeah, this is where we get the bombs. This is going to be fun. This is going to be fun to do. I, I'm going to like this a lot. Okay. It's a pretty windy day out now that I think about it. I don't know why I'm looking back at my green screen for I can't even see outside. But it, is, it has been a pretty windy day out. Even for the, uh, quote-unquote summer. So we got the remote bombs, so this is gonna be fun to use, especially against, uh, the enemies. Okay. And bomb time! Boom! Let's go. And yay! Boom! Hey, yo, give me that treasure. Give me that treasure. Ooh, Travelers Claim more. Oh, pff, who am I? Who am I get? Okay. Bye. I don't need you. <laughs> just throw away a Boko Club. If I find any stronger weapons, I'll just kind of like throw them away. But I'm probably just gonna use. What weapon am I gonna use? I'm probably gonna go for the basic Traveler Sword. Do I even? Ha I don't even have a shield equipped. Oh, my shield broke. That's why. Well. I don't have a shield, so I gotta watch out for- I can't even parry anything- any attacks, so I gotta watch out for that. Wait a minute. I can just throw this. Hold up. Yeet! Boom! That's cool. That's cool. I forgot how cool this game is. Alrighty. Oop. Dropping in the slot. Okay. So we drop her in the slot, wait for it to go- wait for it to close. And then it launches. Launch. Kaboom! Perfect. Okay, and then it kind of shows you like what it's all about. That's cool. 
It basically kind of just shows you what those things do. Interesting. And then I'm guessing we can just launch, yep, launch yourself right over there. Grab this treasure chest, and what did we get? We got some amber. Okay. Nice to know. I need pants. I need some pants. I probably missed that treasure chest that, that the Coblin was at. Unless I have it in my inventory? I do, I just never... I never bothered to put them on! Wow! I am bad at this game. I am just bad. I never pay attention to anything. Okay, can we skip... Can we skip most of this? Okay, guys, so we can pretty much skip these uh, monk things. We're just grabbing orbs. We're getting the stuff done, you know? Oh, cool. Hi. I'm gonna kill- Hey! Hey! I'm taking your- Bacalbon arm, I don't want- Hey! Hey! Stop it! I'm taking your so- Oh, I can't take the sword, you know what? Where's Bacalbon Club? Go away. I didn't mean to pick this back up again. God dang it. Alright, might as well take your shield, because I definitely need that. And I need to find a way to get the heck out of here. And go to the next shrine, which would be all the way down that way. So we gotta go... Oh, there's another EX thing. What is this over here? A Nintendo Switch shirt. The heck? What is it? What is it? It's not stronger. You, you gave me a Nintendo Switch shirt. Screw it, we're keeping it on. We're wearing it, we're wearing it. Alright. We're not wearing it for long, though. We definitely gotta watch out, because there are guardians around here. Especially that one right there. Okay, okay. Hey, yo, spear? I don't need a spear. I got, a, I got swords. I got swords and beat-em-up sticks. Spike... Spiky beam up sticks, actually. Alrighty. So we're traveling around in, in night time. So there's definitely going to be some more skeleton oriented enemies popping up randomly. We definitely got to watch out for those. And it looks like there's also a small camp over there. It's not one of the big camps with the, with the uh, skeleton thing, but we got to definitely make our way up to that shrine up there. Looks like we may have to do some climbing. Which I'm all for. I like climbing. So how are you guys enjoying this playthrough so far? I mean, we've pretty much started, but like... Have you guys enjoyed, enjoyed part one? Part one's definitely... Like, it gets you in there. Oh, <gasps> rush room. Yes, rush rooms. Oh! Come on! Ah, oh, dang it. it. Wasn't quick enough. Fireflies over there. I'm not gonna grab those yet. Oh, there's the old man. Just busy hanging out, you know. Stamella. All right, might as well go into his house and steal all of his stuff. Spicy peppers. Oh, cause we're gonna need something to go in the cold. Hmm. Well, perhaps I shall do that. I'm also going to grab this pot lid because I need a shield. Oh, there's a lizard. Grab the lizard. High tail lizard. Let's go. Okay. Let's grab two stamella mushrooms. Let's grab another Hylian mushroom. Let's go, um, let's cook some stuff. Let's, uh... Let's go get these peppers cooked up and see what that does. Okay. Spicy sautéed peppers with five... Yes, yeah, a low-level cold resistance for five minutes. So this will definitely be helpful when we go all the way up to the snowy area. Alrighty. Now, what we need to do... Other than, um... Okay, woodcutter's axe. So, so we need to cut ourselves a tree down. Nice tree. We need to go about here, I'm guessing? Okay. I don't know how this is gonna work. Alright, falling down, falling down. Ooh, perfect. 
Don't push it off, Link. Don't push it off. Here we go. Going across. Oh, I like how he uses his arms out for balancing. That's cool. Ooh. Oh, wait. There's enemies there. I kind of want to, um... I want to sneak up on them. I need a better weapon, though. To kind of attack... To kind of sneak attack them. Actually, I might... Should I use... I'm going to see if I can use... I'm going to use the Baco Club, because at least... These are like... These are like level 1 enemies, kind of. Like, these are like the... The base level enemies, but I gotta be very quiet. Alrighty. You are going to die. Perfect. That's one. And the next one. Gah! Done. Dead. Alrighty. A d spear? No. No. Not worth it. Okay. Let's go climbing all the way up here. If you guys heard a heard some barking in the background, that is my doggy. My handsome, handsome doggy. I'll probably put up a picture or whatever of him. He's he's cute. There are dogs in this game, by the way. They are Hylian Labradors. That's what they are. Which I guess makes sense because Labradors are probably one of the best breeds of dogs. Come at me. If you come at me, if you disagree, but they are definitely interesting. Can I like? Oh, I can't. I can't do my freaking. Oh, I can't do the thing. I can't do the awesome like mountain trick. Not until I get a glider. Not until I have more stamina, at least. Oof. Because there's this there's a cool glitch that you could do with the uh, with climbing cliffs, where you can kind of like run up it. But this is too steep. Yeah, this is way too steep to even like move on. Also, I like how we could just... Here we go. Let the stamina refill. Climb her back out. I'm pretty sure we could just go back up here, can we? Can we just do this? Can we do this? We could just walk across. I could just walk across. Link, you could walk across. You're fine. Okay. Now we gotta make ourselves all the way up to this one. They definitely make this a lot easier. Oh god, the moon is shining bright on this rock. Thanks for the uh, moonlight, I guess. I mean, it's still it's 3:15 a.m. in game. I mean, right now I'm recording this at like 5:03 p.m. But like, yeah, I remember the in-game time on this passes by five minutes, I guess, per every five seconds, ten seconds or something. I'm, I don't know. Now we gotta make our way up to this one. And I believe should be getting pretty close. There we go. All right, let's fill up that stamina wheel, and up we go up to the top. Do a few jumps. I definitely don't want to risk it too badly, though, because I don't have a butt ton of uh, stamina. And here we are. Oh, a damn shrine! <laughs> I like that. Oh, a damn! Oh, it's oh, it's oh, it's a damn shrine. That's funny. Alrighty, down we go. 